My name is Aliona, and I travel the world by motorcycle with my Honda Hornet, aka the Bee. This time we're heading to Siberia to explore the regions of Altai and Hakasia. We'll have breathtaking views, awesome roads, and a good amount of challenge to make it even more exciting and memorable. Let's ride! Что планируете попутешествовать где-то в Хакасии? <coughs> Пыталась я уйти от поездки в Вергаки, э, но, видимо, не удастся. То есть надо все-таки съездить, потому что она, они меня преследуют. То есть я только решу не ехать. И мне опять кто-нибудь про Ергаки рассказывает. А там так красиво говорят. Вот я думаю, ну ладно, Ергаки, так Ергаки, поехали. Где-то тропа теряться до этого камня, но там все равно эти должны стоять в любом случае идти сперва на художников на художников да на первых художников Good morning <laughs> Алексей and I are a little bit in a hurry uh, Today I'm going to do one thing that I was not going to do <laughs> but Алексей inspired me He is a vivid hiker himself and he inspired me to do a hike in the national park of Yergaki Wish me luck. <laughs> Let's ride. <laughs> My initial plan was to skip Yergaki National Park. But Alexei kept talking about Yergaki and how beautiful it is. So eventually I decided to go. Even though I'm pretty tired after yesterday. <laughs> <sighs> the interview and then we were talking until quite late and planning the route and he was explaining me many things about national park so I went to bed pretty late oh that's it we're on the straight road out of the city and down to the national park it's about 200 something kilometers so it's quite a ride let's go do it <laughs> now we're crossing the river Yenisei and on this side of the river the Yenisei is the Republic of Hakasia and the other side of Yenisei where we're heading to is the region of Krasnoyarsk so actually the park the national park Yergaki is not in Hakasia and so what who cares what's important is that we're going back to the proper mountains I'm so excited about these views Whee! oh yeah <laughs> Here are my curves and just about 40 kilometers left until the national park. We I'm starting to see some snow. Oh my god! Oh wow! <laughs> Look at this! This is Yergaki! <laughs> this is where I'm going! Oh wow! <laughs> I need a photo. Snow, snow, snow! Oh my god, that view! Hmm, a tunnel! Unbelievable beauty! And look at this lake! So sweet! A day full of curves and hiking among these beautiful pine trees. Oh wow! The weather forecast is looking really good should be clear skies 
and about like 15 20 degrees here perfect for hiking and we should be very close to the visit center here we go the visit center the entrance is free but you have to be registered in case something happens to you so they go searching this is a proper national park I got registered and the lady told me that yesterday it was snowing here in the mountains so one of the places that I had in mind I will not be able to get there and that's very good because that would be a very <laughs> very tough hike so I'm doing a slightly easier version and now I'm going two kilometers to the start of the trail saving myself some effort exciting day ahead lots of workout Alright, so I changed to my hiking <laughs> gear <laughs> and starting the trail. Exciting! Mm, very good smelling pine trees, beautiful sunshine. Of course, forgot the sunscreen. <laughs> so I'll probably burn a little bit today. But oh my god, so pleasant. I've got around seven hours in total until I have to be back with the bee and make our way back to Abakan. These beautiful, beautiful flowers. Wow. No, you just look at this beauty. Oh my God, so pretty. You know what? I've missed hiking. Oh, being alone with the nature. Enjoying the sun, the birds singing, observing the flowers and the butterflies. We must be getting close to our first viewpoint. It's called the Rainbow Lake. I've now been walking for about an hour, so it's time to have a little snack. When I hike, I usually try to eat something just a tiny little bit every hour to keep the energy level even <laughs> oh wow look at this view I like what I'm saying so here is the rainbow lake super super pretty so I've got the 10 minutes for a break and I'm looking at the map drawn by Alexei and trying to figure out what my next step is. And also eating my little snack. These are dried apricots. Mm -hmm. My plan done by Alexei. So this one is the lake, the circle one. And from here, one and a half hours up to something called legs. I think it's gonna be a peak somewhere up there. And I guess that rock up there is the Henning stone, Henning rock. So that's the typical route. And you can see this is the Henning rock on the map. We'll pass by it on our way down. So it means that we should be heading somewhere up there. So probably this is our trail. Oh, this is the head. Look at this. You can see the head? We should be going somewhere up to those feet. That's gonna be interesting. <laughs> All right, so this is starting to get more challenging. More exciting, of course. <laughs> yep, that's the trail. Let's go. Whoop, whoop, whoop. I left the leg behind down there. Oh, 
I have serious doubts regarding how I'm supposed to be doing that mountain pass. I don't know, it's somewhere up there next to the feet. Well, I suppose it has been done before, so it should be possible. <laughs> Slowly getting higher and higher. These are the feet already. And that's the head. And look at these cute flowers. So sweet. And these ones. And snow. <laughs> so I'm walking right next to the head already and heading towards the feet. Now the fun part starts. Whew. That's the feet and the uphill. But so far the trail is quite all right. It really doesn't seem as bad as it looks like from the bottom. Of course it's steep, but doable. Like it's not rock climbing at least. Just some steep stairs. Maybe it is a little bit steep. Sometimes I have to use my hands. But I'm almost there. Almost there. Whew. Here we go. Snow top. Made it to the top! <sighs> now you just look at this beauty. Lakes, mountains. And now we'll continue up along the ridge. Somewhere towards there. I think that's the painter's mountain pass. Let's go! Almost done with the second mountain pass. You can see this is a trail which goes through the feet that I just took. And look at this. Wow, super cool. I think I have found my perfect lunch spot. Beautiful view on one side, beautiful view on the other side. I'm sheltered from the wind, nice and sunny. Also, it's 3 p.m. now, so I'll have a half an hour lunch break and then I'll be heading back to the bee so we can go back to Abakan. I'm st ah! <laughs> almost fell. <laughs> I'm standing here on a rock <laughs> in the middle of everything. So, yeah, I'm super satisfied with this hike. It's amazingly beautiful and perfect weather what do we have for lunch? chorizo? <laughs> mm. cucumber? <laughs> cucumber? <laughs> and um, bread? simple mountain hike lunch so tasty mm. <laughs> quick look at the other side before we start heading back Oh, there was still a whole universe to explore here. Next time. Goodbye, Painter's Pass. You're really beautiful. Really beautiful. Starting the way back. And now we're going to go down this trail around the lake. And up to that hanging rock up there. Look. That's where I just had lunch. And I'm already down here. I'm starting to get a little bit tired. But look at this. Oh my god, so beautiful. Dear nature, how can you be so beautiful? A little bit of snow. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> so 
super, super cool. Here we go. The hanging rock. It was a little bit scary actually <laughs> to be under this gigantic rock and right next to <laughs> the abyss. <laughs> wow. <laughs> The size of this rock is absolutely incredible. Wow. <laughs> all right, last bit. You see this trail? And it goes all the way to that building. That's where the bees parked. Let's go! Last effort for today. A little river crossing. So cute. My phone ran out of battery and the charger didn't work. This last effort, oh my god, it wasn't as easy as I expected it to be. I took a last transited uh, trail, of course. Alona is Alona. I couldn't go back down the same trail, so... And that trail, it was like stream crossings. It was, oh my god, a lot of water. Both of my shoes are completely wet. Like this actually has a little bit of dry here. This one is completely wet. I ended up stepping into one of the streams. <laughs> Oops. All right, now it's 200 kilometers back to Abakan. <sighs> Almost there, right? <laughs> Goodbye, beautiful Yurigaki. It was even more adventurous than what I expected it to be. But that was a fun one. A hike is not a hike if you don't come back completely exhausted and with wet feet. <laughs> so that's what I am right now. Oof. And of course it's one hour until sunset, so... bit in a hurry and we'll probably be coming back in the dark and I should feed the bee on the way <laughs> oh beautiful curvy roads I'm gonna miss you the sunset beauty So beautiful. Abakan! <laughs> we made it. <laughs>